In the quiet town of Millville, a group of pals, Jake, Emma, Ben, and Lily gathered near the entrance of the old Millville factory. The crumbling structure stood as a relic of the past, its towering walls holding stories of a time long gone. The friends, intrigued by tales of strange echoes and mysteries, decided to explore the deserted factory one gloomy afternoon. The air inside was thick with the scent of rust and decay as they ventured deeper into the labyrinthine corridors. Guided only by faint daylight filtering through broken windows, footsteps echoed through the empty halls, and the occasional creak of old machinery added to the eerie atmosphere. Jake, the leader of the group, couldn't help but shiver as they entered the vast assembly hall, a massive space where shadows played in the dim light. As they went further, the air grew colder, and a distant, haunting melody reached their ears. A chill settled over the group as they followed the spectral music, unable to determine its source. In the heart of the factory, they stumbled upon an ancient control room, its machinery frozen in time. Dust-covered buttons and switches seemed to beckon, and a flickering control panel emitted an eerie glow. Unable to resist, Jake pressed a long, neglected lever. The factory came alive with a haunting symphony of creaks and groans. Lights flickered overhead, casting eerie shadows. The distant melody grew louder, now accompanied by an unsettling chorus of whispers seemingly emanating from the very walls. Suddenly, the factory transformed. What was once a relic of the past became a spectral dance floor, with ghostly figures twirling in the shadows. The friends, paralyzed with awe and terror, watched as the ethereal dancers moved in perfect harmony with the haunting melody. As panic set in, they realized they were trapped in a ghostly performance. The figures closed in, their faces hidden beneath tattered veils. In a desperate move, Jake reached for the control panel and reversed the lever. The haunting symphony screeched to a halt, and the spectral dancers froze mid-motion. Gasping for breath, the friends stumbled out of the factory. The evening sky, once gloomy, now held the soft hues of dawn. The air outside felt warm compared to the chilling embrace of the abandoned halls. As they made their way home, the friends couldn't shake the lingering unease. The boundary between the living and the spectral had blurred within the walls of the Millville factory. The haunting melody and the ghostly dance would forever remain etched in their memories, a testament to the otherworldly secrets hidden in the heart of the forgotten industrial relic.